Hey guys, this is a tutorial on uh, how I get my hair the way it is. This is very, very highly requested and it's so easy, so let's get started. So I've just gotten out of the shower and my hair is pretty wet. Um, yeah, you don't have to take a shower or wash your hair, it just needs to be wet basically. And then I'm going to chuck it in a towel and yeah. I don't really know how else to explain that. And then I'm going to be a noob for a bit. I'm going to, you know, get ready for bed. I'm going to brush my teeth and put my retainer in, which is disgusting. Be thankful if you don't have to wear a retainer because it's horrible. Um, and, you know, put my moisturizer on. Why I filmed this, I don't know. It's just what I do while I'm waiting for my hair to dry. Um, it doesn't really go up for long anyway. So after I take my hair out, I go through it with a comb. Um, if you do not comb through your hair, you will get epic tangles. I will tell you that now, and they are not fun to try and get out. So, I always comb through my hair. Then I'm just going to take some bobby pins, and I'm going to pin my fringe back, because I know when I tie my hair up, those bits fall out, um, if I don't have them bobby pinned. Then I'm going to gather all of my hair to the top of my head, just like that. Um... It's not really the most attractive hairdo, but I'm sleeping on it, so yeah. Um, and then I'm just going to secure it in a bun, and it doesn't have to be like a neat bun, it doesn't have to be like a ballerina bun, like I said, you're just sleeping on it, as long as it's secure. Um, and then I'm going to bobby pin all the other bits that would fall out, and then I'm going to sleep on it. And yeah, nighty night. <laughs> um, okay, so in the morning I do my makeup and I get dressed and eat my breakfast. My hair is always the last thing that I do because I want it to give um, long enough to dry. Then I take it out of its hair lackey and take all the bobby pins out. Um, I should have cut this. <laughs> um, and then I just, you know, move all the hair around and make sure it all goes in the right place, you know, I don't want bits from one side being on the other side, and that'll just get annoying, and as you can see, it looks pretty crazy at the moment, so we're going to use the straightener just to neaten it up a little bit, um, I don't straighten with the straightener, that sort of defeats the curly purpose, the curly hair purpose, can't talk today, um, I'm just going to flip my fringe, sometimes this works better than other days, today was a day where it didn't really work that well, but what can you do um and then yeah i'm gonna do the side because that's always a bit messy because that gets clipped up as you saw last night so that's never really straight and i mean that's never really curly <laughs> i really can't talk today i'm sorry um and then i'm just gonna go through all the other bits in my hair that are messy um or you know that kind of are weird curls that i don't like um bits that haven't curled properly, all the bottom pretty much is fine, like the base of it, but like my short layers and everything, they're all parts that I curl. And then I just spray it with a whole lot of hairspray because I don't want my curls to drop, that will make me cry. It's the most depressing thing ever when my curls drop. Because I'm a curly hair girl, you know, that's just how I am. So that really is it. It is so easy. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.